Hey, what is going on guys? It's the Alice Project here and welcome back to Hearts of Iron for Millennium Dawn as the Roman Empire. Now, um, last episode got kind of interrupted. We've just finished uh, the best engineer company out there. So we're going to go recon. And uh, last episode we took care of Jordan and uh, this episode we're probably going to take care of Morocco, which is no easy feat because fucking Morocco has a huge army. Like a huge one. Look at this. They're they're a fucking superpower. What the fuck? Um what's going on in Sweden? Yeah, fascists seem to take over. Much the same for Brazil. Um in the USA they're stuck at twenty percent because well, they're at twenty one now apparently. But they're never gonna make it anyway. Because the US uh probably went down the How's it called? The, the the path of the founding fathers or something like that. Just choosing the dominance of one part or the other. Right, let's get airburst weapons. Ooh, we need more aluminium. Right, let's get it from China. Just see how long... Okay, these guys are half ready. Just wanted to check. Alright, uh, let's give them Giuseppe Volato, because why not? But yeah, Imperium Romanum is quite big right now. We just need... Um, Israel's really annoying, because I cannot take it out without provoking a major war. But uh, some interesting suggestions popped up, so I'm boosting uh, fascists, even though that's going to take a fucking while. And I'm going to stage a coup of sorts. But yeah, the main issue is I cannot connect uh, these two lands. So Israel is kind of in the, in the way. Right, let's move my air force over to Tunisia. Until we take the... Is there anything close to these guys? No? L really? <laughs> they have no airports apparently. have a massive army but no airports or airfields. Let's increase the size of our fighter to 600 now. Doop, there we go. We have a massive air force, and that's great. I think we really need a massive air force. For example, we're producing two attack aircraft per day and 1.79 multi rolls per day. That's great. That's really great. That's that's some good production right there. <clears throat> Oops, there we go. The missing piece of the puzzle just joined. And uh, most, yep, all of my neighbors are now in NATO. Wonderful. Well, that's not going to be an easy task. When's Russia going to invade these guys? They have a war goal. They're just not going against them still. And uh, Ukraine's... These guys are on... <laughs> Scraping the barrel. Wow. Yep. They haven't budged. I think they're buggy right here. I'm not sure why that's going on. But eh, I don't care. I hope that Sweden turns fascist soon, so does Brazil. Because they could be a useful asset. These guys are still, yeah, they're going back. They're fluctuating between 20 and 21. I need to be careful with Montenegro because Montenegro is social or conservative, whatever. And uh, I'm pretty sure that... Who does NATO allow? Conservatives or social liberals? Oh, never mind. Let's go improve C signal companies. I cannot see who they're accepting. Because I'm the leader of a faction myself. Right, well, these guys can stop exercising. That's for sure. And uh, soon we'll be able to, or I can start justifying a war goal. Well, let's go for whatever. 
we need to improve our defenses at the Alpine Wall, and we've actually finished it, so I'm quite proud. Um, but yeah, we're gonna need to strengthen the layers of defenses on here. Uh, I need to check what's the division setup of these guys. Um, Alright, we need to give them some... Uh, okay, let's just quickly check. We have a nice industry, so we can now expand these. Uh, I shall actually give them some infantry battalions. Uh, actual infantry, because they need to be good. Just defending. So, um, give them more artillery. That's great, that's, that's going to improve the defense quite a bit. Uh, so, that, so will the HP. Uh, let's give them field hospitals. Let's give them recon. Let's give them support anti-air and uh, support anti-tank. That's going to require me to build a lot more other stuff. For example, the anti-tank. Uh, but I also need to start producing anti-air. Which I need to improve because it's shite. But anti-air is going to be good. Um, for taking out enemy, possible enemy aircraft that's, that they're, they're gonna try and bomb me with. And they're also good with piercing at, at times, so why not? So the Alpine Brigade now has really, really good defense. Solid attack, both hard and soft. Decent air attack. Their breakthrough is solid. Good piercing, which is great, because I want to, I want them to break their teeth. At the border. So, what do we miss most of all? We're missing anti air. Anti air, yes. Right, so we shall uh, focus anti air for a little while. Um, we have plenty of motorized for now, so let's just uh, give those to anti air. That's, we have plenty of you guys, give it to anti air. I have quite a bit of you, so we'll remove one. There we go. Let's check the trade. Surplus. There we go. There we go, alright. <clears throat> so, uh, our invasion of Morocco is going to start in a little bit. And um, that's going to go great, I think. Because if we take these two, maybe we'll actually take out Morocco without any major losses. Just hope that these guys handle the defense. So far, uh, our, Roman little, our little Roman Empire is quite secure. And uh, I'm just going to wear out NATO on the borders. But again, as of right now, I really just need a lot of anti-air. We need to upgrade it as well. So once the... 2018 battle tanks, which are eight years in advance. Once they pop out, we're gonna be good. All right, so let's actually improve our steel industry, especially in the center here. And uh, what else do we need a lot of? So we can, we're importing. Okay, well, uh, we have a decent amount of this. Um, what do we lack that we need to import? Oh yeah, we're importing a shit ton of tungsten. Right, so tungsten it is. Right, tungsten down here. Alright, let's go. And after that, did I... Didn't I make... Oh, no, I didn't make anti-air defenses here. So we need to strengthen the border. Against these guys. Most definitely. I'm not really concerned about all of this. They can do naval invasions here. I'll probably be able to defend it quite easily. Uh, but we must not let Rome itself fall. I think that one of these divisions is good enough to defend the whole mainland. But, uh, yeah, we'll probably reinforce it as well. So we will be going to war in uh, 10 days. And yeah, it's going to be happening in this episode. Now, I have bad memories from uh, invading Morocco last time, or at least defend, not defending Algeria from Morocco. So I'm going to be rather careful with all of this. Alright, why are you guys... These guys are just endlessly 
justifying against Latvia because they're, they're never going to do anything. How are, how are our uh, fascists in Israel doing? Seven percent, GG. We're still not at very high stability. We actually haven't had that many. Oh, there we go. These guys are at forty-three percent. They should change at forty-five. Right, so let's go take claim states. Navy's already protecting us. Let's get these guys moving. Ooh, damn! Right, we need to send in the air force. Damn. These guys are. They're feisty. They're feisty ones, alright. But, yeah, we'll hold. I think we'll hold. No, we will not. At least not there. But we will hold uh, elsewhere, so... Just reinforce that line. We should be okay. Yeah, they've already lost, like, 16k. We're gonna lose a lot of people here, but... It's okay. As long as most of their army... Oh, there we go. We have armatas. We have fucking armatas. Now, yeah, that's very advanced. Um, let's actually go improve our entire because it's very, very old. All right, T14 Armadas, I'm actually gonna improve your armor, your main gun, and uh, your engine a bit. There we go. All right, so build that. Well, let's see how this goes. Why are these guys not moving? Ah, oh, probably not enough. Oh, we're gonna take this at the very least. Oh, there we go. All right. Ah, you guys cannot move. All right. Well, uh, we'll just do this, and uh, we will move you. There, literally. There's no naval. This is not a naval base. You're shitting me, right? Uh. All right. All right. Let's just see. Are they retreating? Well, they're retreating some troops from the line. So we shall... We shall indeed uh, be swift about this. We have more military factories, I'll sign that later. Uh, you guys can move. Let's go, 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 go. We need to be faster and we need to move all of our marines in as well. You, fuck, you guys are fucking slow. I don't have a naval base right there, so that's an issue. If we're caught off guard, we're gonna be fucked. Brutally, brutally fucked. If we don't take this. I actually priority to building a... How quickly can you build one? 16th of April. It's gonna be risky. Thought we were gonna take this, but hopefully these guys will be able to sneak by and capture this. We can bring in even more marines to hold the line for now. All right, you guys don't push, you guys push. Alright, push them back. Give them some breathing space. Just moderate pushes. Let's not get too crazy. Because I know how crazy you guys can get. Alright, you guys actually need to stop because you are fucking yourself up. So are you. Oh great. Why does why is Morocco so hard to take out? Why? Somebody tell me. Right, well at least these guys will go escape goats. Yeah, we're gonna lose fifteen or thirteen divisions. Oh Russia's sending them fucking support. Thank you, Russia. Thank you so much. Right, the only chance you guys have is to push. Alright? Push. Push. That's the only chance you guys have to save yourself. Uh, we're gonna have to kinda sacrifice these lot. Th this lot. But you guys have to push. You need to push and need to do it fast. Because if you don't, you're gonna get encircled and bone fucked. Yep. Alright, alright. You're just there. You're almost there. Okay, so these guys are not dead, so it's not as massive of a failure. We've just lost three divisions. Ah, yeah, three. Alright, these guys should be able to get supplies. Alright, so we're good. These guys have made a nice push. Let's uh, send the reinforcements. 
Oh, great. Why can't we... So, what? Now we don't have Suter, and now we cannot go around. You're fucking me, right? Need to go all around Africa to get these guys reinforced. <laughs> oh, this is some immense buttfuckery. Alright, send them across. Alright, at least we're gonna hold Casablanca. They cannot take it from us. I don't think. I mean, they can fucking attack us constantly. They can probably take it from us, I'm sorry. <laughs> so yeah, these guys need to be swift about their attack. Yeah, these guys can only hold for so long. Yeah, but we're doing okay. It's a bloody war, but... Ah, oh, there we go. Our guys are doing swell. Navy's here. So at least our convoys are not going to get bombed. Why does Morocco have such a massive fucking army? This is unbelievable. We have air domination, that's good. Alright, these guys need to advance more. Okay, okay, these guys actually got a braver. That's great. Alright, anti air upgrades done. That should probably end the episode. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. The invasion of Morocco is not as simple as we thought it would be. We've lost three divisions, but what's three divisions, honestly? Um, but yeah, hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye.